2K13 was a big part of our game. It brought a different element to the game. Uh, so we brought it back for 2K14. We introduced a few new ones uh, that we really feel like are going to hit different parts of the game that we didn't actually get to last year. One of the main parts is uh, the pick and roll game. Um, pick and roll obviously is a very big part of the NBA and so we created one for the ball handler and one for the actual screener. So we've got the pick and roll maestro. He's the guy that handles the ball in the pick and roll. He'll get a little bit of a boost um, on his passing off the pick and roll and his shooting. And we've got the screen outlet. He's the guy that's actually going to be setting the screen for you. And so if you can actually find a team that has both of these guys or you can combine a team with both of these guys, you can create a pretty powerful pick and roll game in NBA 2K14. When the community guys came in, one of the signature skills that they enjoyed the most was what we call flashy passer. It actually complements the new flashy pass stick that we have. You can throw some super sick passes onto the legs, behind the back, accurate passes with the flashy passer. We, you know, we're pretty strict about what you can get away with, but once you pull off that pass, it's pretty amazing. Last year we had a, a signature skill called Scrapper, and it actually encompassed both rebounding and hustle plays. We actually wanted to split that apart because we felt like some guys were good at the scrapping stuff and some guys were good at rebounding, so we kind of split that up and now we kept Scrapper basically as it was except took the rebounding stuff out and we created a Tenacious Rebounder. Tenacious Rebounder is going to win your box out battles, he's going to obviously try box out moves more often, and he's going to be able to rip rebounds from the air a little bit better than most players. One of the new signature skills we created on the defensive side of the ball is the pick dodger. He's a guy that doesn't get caught up on screens very easily. And we have different resolutions when a player hits a, hits a guy on a screen. He can either go around it or under it, but sometimes he gets clobbered by it. Well, a pick dodger actually has an easier time going over it and around it, and uh, he can keep up with the ball handler a little better. Personally, my favorite new six skill that we brought this year is what we call one-man fast break. Um, there's a lot of guys in the NBA that can take the rebound and go coast to coast, weave in through traffic and finish, you know, finish with a, an awesome layup or a dunk. And so we really wanted to model that this year and we created the new six skill called one-man fast break. When you pre-order NBA 2K14, you get one extra signature skill in the King James bonus pack. We called it the LeBron Coast to Coast skill. It's actually a little bit of a one-man fast break and a little bit of finisher. It essentially gives you the one-man fast break skill all the way up and down the court, and then it combines that with what we had last year, the finisher, when you're finishing the actual fast break. Just like last year, we're very excited about the signature skills that we brought to you in 2K14. Uh, we really felt like we hit some of the major parts of gameplay again this year. Um, we really think you're going to enjoy the new skills that we brought you. NBA 2K14 comes out October 1st. Go get it.